G'day, Sam O'Hare. Bit of work in the kitchen, dining room. It's all pretty much the nuts. I've taken some. Uh, took a I took a honey super off my strongest hive today. Uh, I probably could have taken about another two or three, maybe even four, off of all of my hives. But I'm not being greedy at this stage. I just want to get a few ready for Christmas gifts. Get some cone honey ready for Christmas gifts. And get a little bit cut up for packaging up for the market. So there's my honey. All in the frame. These are, in Australia they're called Ideal. They're 5 and 3 eighths inches high. Just done 140 millimetres. Don't have an imperial tape handy, so. But yeah, I think pretty sure they're five and three eighths inches. I don't put foundation in them, only a starter strip, maybe about an inch wide at the most. So I'm just going to cut it into, I'll cut it out of the frame, then I'll cut it into thirds and package it up into the containers. And once I've got the frames out, I'll just put them straight into the super that I took off the hive and I can go straight back out this afternoon, straight back on the hive. And yes, this is going to be a messy process. That's why I've got cardboard down, oven paper. This one here, I think I'll cut up about there. Again, about there. Not an exact science. Now, these chunks here, I'd say they'd weigh close to a pound. I think about 400 grams. All you do is put a lid on, put the label on, take it to market. Hopefully I can sell them for about $10 a chunk. See how we get on. There we go, all packaged up, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. All I've got to do now is print a label and do the other seven frames. Um, I may save one frame just to a crush and strain. A couple of people are after a bit of honey. I don't like comb honey. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.